Mr Nevins here with another tutorial. Uh, today we're talking about the 6-8 March Bonnie Dundee. So at this point uh, we've already played a couple of 6-8s. We've played Cork Hill, that's in 6-8. We've played Flower of Scotland, that's in 6-8. And we've played the Bugle Horn, which is another 6-8 March. So the good news is here, in terms of uh, new ideas, there aren't really any to cover. The tune has a, a, a selection of the technique we went through. Doublings, grips, strikes, single grace notes. Um, that sort of stuff. Um, but really there's only one addition. It's not really an addition, it's a variation. So we are used to the consistent, well not the consistent, the archetypal rhythm of a 6-8 march being 1, a 3, 2, a 3, 1, a 3, 2, a 3. Okay. Now that's also true in this tune as well. The only thing we notice is that our third bar in the first line we swap round the semi-quaver and the dotted quaver. So we get one a two, two a two. Okay. Da he dum da he dun. That's how that's going to sound. So that's the thing you try to bear in mind there is there's nothing really new in the piece. Uh, and of course we've selected this to go along with the bugle horn to give us four parts in six eight. So uh, if you look at your bugle horn score, you'll notice that there's a little C and D at the end of the last line. That's the anacrusis into this, this tune, and that's where I'm going to begin. So like I said, there's there's no new technique here. Um, if you've looked through the score and you don't recognise anything, please go back and visit other tutorials or ask me in lessons. Okay. Um, if you don't know what the technique is, please go and sort out the technique first, rather than try to you know, fight your way through this piece. I'd rather you knew what you were doing. So here we go. I've got the metronome here set on 2 beats in the bar, 60 beats per minute, and I've got it set on triplets. So we've got it here three quavers per beat and it'll sound like this. One, two, three, two, two, three. Okay, here we go. So we start with the anacrusis. One, two, three, two. That's it. That's the point on D. Again, feel free, rewind, listen back, play along, listen to the listen to the recording while you read the score. All that sort of stuff will be a great aid to you. And I'll catch you all in the next lesson. See you.